What's up, guys? It's your man MP, and today I'm introducing you to Jake Runyon and his partner Chase Kaminsky. These guys took something as innocent as fishing and made it into something else by cheating. Now, to give you guys some context, this was in the Lake Erie Walleye Trail Championship this week. This is a huge tournament for fishermen. First prize was $45,000. The tournament goes off of total weight, so the lead weights in the video were used to add 8 pounds to their total weight. And before that, these guys won qualifying events with prizes that were over $10,000. Now, just to put things into perspective for you guys, first place was $45,000 in this competition. But this guy's made almost $3 million in his pro fishing career. So there's no telling how much money he's stolen from other competitors in the past. In one competition alone, he recently won $300,000. I'm sorry. He recently stole $300,000 from someone else. So it's no wonder that the rest of these fishermen are so pissed off. They spent money on this. They spent lots of time on this. And these guys just cheated. Guys, I'm from Florida. And for a lot of people, fishing is simply a way of life. Some kids grow up dreaming of having their own boat one day. Most of the time, you have to wake up very early to go fishing, like 4 or 5 o'clock in the morning. There's a lot of work involved. You're ha you have to load up your boat. You have to buy bait. You also have to spend money on fishing gear. You're probably not going to have anything hot to eat for several hours. You have to pack your food. There's a lot of expenses that go into this. And you know, you're not always guaranteed a fish. But people do it because they love it. So for these guys to turn a dream job for a lot of people, like getting paid to fish, you messed up a dream job for a lot of people, stupid. And to top it all off, these guys have been accused of cheating before. They had to take a polygraph test. And then after the polygraph test, which I guess they failed one, but then in another place they were actually able to pass the polygraph test, they made a big deal about how their reputation is so important to them and how they're going to speak to an attorney about what to do. You guys are so stupid. You almost got away with this, but you decided to be greedy and keep cheating. 
and you were mad extra. They were really laying it on thick when the whole time they were cheating, talking about they want to speak to an attorney. When they were cheating, like shut up, you cheating ass cheaters. Guys, as of now, I don't know what's going to happen to these guys. I know they definitely didn't get rewarded the prize money. And the police had to escort them out of there before they got their asses kicked by the rest of the fishermen. But as far as any fraud charges or any charges being brought to them or them having to give back prize money from past events, I don't know about that yet, but I'll definitely keep you guys posted. But as always, guys, I appreciate you watching. We post lots of random content. So if you like stuff like this and you see the subscribe, like, and notification button adding some lead weights to their walleyes, make sure you push them into the water. Thanks again for watching.